and picking up a first down with his feet. From the 22-yard line, play action on first down across the middle, and the catch is made for a first down, and right on cue, the All-American Cup with the grab, and a first down. Out there when, uh, when he's carrying the football. Four receiver look, and this is a quarterback draw. In some trouble, Goober making something happen. He's inside the 20 and close to the first down. That passing game to receive it. Four receiver look this time. Gubrud puts one into a tight spot. Do at the wide receiver position. You cannot just double team him and take him away. And Cup now a record holder after that grab, and they go to Cup again inside the 20 yard line. And not this asset, not just to this Eagles football program, but the entire university and community as well. Gubrud with time in the pocket, back in the end zone. He's looking for Cup there. And Mike Keels on the coverage, and there's a flag thrown in the back portion of that end zone on that play. Pass interference on the defense, number four. The ball will be placed in the two-yard line. Automatic first down. They have Cooper Cup's jersey as he was trying to elevate and get that football. Cooper Cup, 6,190 yards receiving all division, no matter what division of football, FCS, Division two, three. Heck, uh, intramurals, he holds <laughs> this week. Ellison getting the nod this week as they'll go play action this time. And a miscommunication there. Cup now from the seven. They go end around, get it to Splendorio, and the spider shut it down. A 9 of 11 through the air, 74 yards and a touchdown, looking on a third and two, and he's intercepted. Trying to go across the middle, and he's picked off by Kieran Gregory. Eagles, and going to work on first down is the quarterback, Gubrud, in trouble. He escapes his safety, delivers a strike to Cup across the 20. He's across the 40. Cup into the clear. Cooper Cup. Finally dragged down at the 24-yard line. Micah Keels finally caught up with him there, but Gubrud escaped a potential safety and a huge play. We talk about Gubrud's ability to buy time in the pocket. This time escapes almost a sure safety, but keeps his eyes downfield and finds his number one guy, Cooper Cup. And then after that, Cooper Cup just uses his legs and picks up a huge, huge gain. Such a half turning play. He's got him in the red zone now, second down. Short pass play, goes low and it's incomplete. As he was looking for Cup, and there's Cup with that shoulder again. The AC joint, he's playing through a lot of pain. It's a, certainly a painful injury. That's not a tattoo on his arm. That's that kinesio tape trying to help him uh, deal with that pain, that left shoulder. AC sprains can be very, very painful. Something you can fight through. 71 yard pass play. And then the pass low, and Cup takes a shot. Yeah, Cup reached out with his left hand to try to get that pass. Was a little that was a little low, and it was Justin Rubin, the safety from the Spiders, put a good shot in that left shoulder. Even if he wasn't nicked up, I would suspect he'd be in a little bit of pain. But being worried that he is, he's back out there on this next play. And they're not going to try field goal. They're going for it. Fourth and six. Gubrud to the end zone. Cup goes low. He's got it for the touchdown. of the season fighting through the left shoulder injury the 71 yard pass reception and then the catch to make it 13 of him this is nothing new for the faith we did this last week got knocked out the game came back in the game and caught a touchdown on the next play he does it again two weeks in a row the legend of cooper cup just keeps growing and growing nine gubrud 11 of 17 through the air steps up in the pocket throws on the run and it's knocked away intended for cup and a good play made there by from Williams, Virginia. Guru throws the football, but doesn't lead his receiver cup enough uh, where Daniel Jones is able to come back and make a reception for Richmond. They have really struggled. Kendrick Bourne now on an end around, and he gets it up to the 40-yard line for three yards. Drive going here. To the sideline, and that's Cup, and that's a first down. Out of bounds at midfield. And third and five. They need to get it inside the five-yard line. Gubrud looking, has some time, still standing in the pocket. Now he rolls right. Now he throws, and it's incomplete. Intended for Cup, it'll be fourth down. Single back, four receiver look. On second down, into coverage. It's caught by Bourne. There were two receivers there. He ran into Cup. And somehow uh, hung on to the football. Now, Cup a little bit shaken up, I think, again. That left shoulder. Definitely a miscommunication or a bad route between Cup 
been born. You, should, you wouldn't want two receivers in the same area at the same time. It doesn't. It draws too many defenders to the football. That time, Bourne does a good job of outfighting Cup for the football. And as you saw right there on the replay, Cup on the left shoulder, a little dinged a little bit with that collision with Bourne.